Hey folks, Will Brink here at www.brinkzone.com. Today I want to cover a topic of much confusion for some people, which is the difference between uh, whey concentrate and whey isolates. Uh, I've seen a lot of confusion over this, and I think most of that comes from, uh, again, marketers uh, purposely confusing the issue to uh, sell one or the other, and uh, I'm going to straighten that up. So, for beginners, let me just start off the top. There is no functional difference between isolates and concentrates uh, as far as your body is concerned. The difference between an isolate and a concentrate is more or less as it sounds. Uh, isolates have higher protein content, usually about 90% or slightly above. Concentrates have lower protein content. Uh, they can be quite low, but as far as the commercial market's concerned, with what you know is in the <clears throat> in supplements, uh, it's going to be in the 70 to 80 percent range. That's your typical concentrate. Uh, the differences between concentrates and isolates are mostly physical. Uh, that is, concentrates are going to have more are going to have lactose, which isolates generally are lactose free. So if you have problems with lactose, you want an isolate. Uh, they're going to have more fat in a concentrate. There's going to be more ash, and there's going to be some other constituents that concentrates have that isolates don't. And there are reasons you might want isolates. But if an isolate, if you don't have any problems with lactose and that type of thing, and you're paying double the price for an isolate that you would for a concentrate, you know, it doesn't make much sense to for that 10% or 5% uh, difference in protein content. Because believe me, again, it's, as far as protein replacement, as far as the uh, beneficial effects physically, um, they're going to be functionally the same. Uh, and it should be noted that all of the research that was done on whey, showing all the benefits of whey, of which I've written quite a bit as far as uh, immunity, cancer, uh, glutathione, that type of thing, these were all done on concentrates. Uh, some later studies, more recently of course, were done isolates, but understand that the, the research that shows the benefits of uh, whey, uh, most of it was all done on concentrates. So there's nothing wrong with concentrates. Uh, from a functional point of view, um, again, you are going to get less protein, you are going to get more lactose, that type of thing, but as far as uh, getting the extra protein and such and getting the benefits, there's, there's functionally no difference. And uh, <clears throat> the article you want to read for more details on that is called The Way It Is, and that can be found on the Brink Zone. And that's uh, our way conversation for the day. If you like this information, please hit the like button below, Twitter, what have you, and I'll see you on the Brink Zone www.bringzone.com where you'll find my blog, more videos, free reports on fat loss, muscle building, supplementation, fitness, health, and longevity, as well as a ton of articles and my free weekly newsletter. And I hope to see you all on the Brink Zone.